Good morning, everyone. So uh, today I've decided to do a new challenge, where I live off for live off of one dollar for the day. So yeah, uh, I definitely stole this idea from Callum's Corner. So uh, go check him out. Today I'm going to be living off of one dollar for the day. Um, but I'm not gonna like go to the store with a dollar and buy food because you can't really buy much with just a dollar so what I've done is I've taken each of my like I've calculated the price of an egg and the price of a slice of bread and I've just added it all together so I'm gonna have my morning walk and then I'll come back and have breakfast and I'll tell you guys uh, what food I have for today all right, I'm back from my run walk. It was a bit cold, but that doesn't matter. What does matter is uh, I gotta show you what I'm gonna be eating today. All right, so for food for today, we got about four eggs. That's, they're about nine cents each. That's about 36 cents. We got two slices of bread. That's about 12 cents each, which is 24 cents. We got two tablespoons of butter, which is about 20 cents and uh, the treat for today we got one packet of ramen which I've seen a lot of I've seen a lot of different prices I've seen like I've seen down to 10 cents or up to 30 cents and I figured I'd take the average of two, those two numbers which is also the number I saw the most which was uh, five for one which was 20 cents per packet of ramen so yeah for breakfast this morning though I'm going to be having one egg and one piece of toast and breakfast is served all right so we're here i mean we're in my room now because i don't want to annoy my family anymore but yeah this is breakfast for today it's just just an egg on toast i mean it's probably it's i mean it's probably what i would normally have normally i wouldn't do as much butter because i tried to do a tablespoon of butter but that was just too much. I used half a tablespoon to fry the egg, which was a lot. And then I used a quarter of a tablespoon on the toast, which was, which I feel like that's going to be a lot of butter. When I was doing this, I had no idea how much butter I actually used in a day. And I can tell you it's not two tablespoons. So I have two and a quarter tablespoons left. I'm probably not going to use it all, but oh well. All right, let's dig in. It's what I it's what I expect. Also, the only drink I've allowed myself to drink in this challenge is water, so probably gonna be a lot drinking a lot of that. All right, that was breakfast. Pretty good. I mean, it's probably what I would like normally have, except I would normally put like maybe a little bit of sriracha or pepper on it, but it's pretty good. So yeah, that was breakfast down. Next up. Uh, I think I'm going to shower, going to upload today's video, because I'm filming this on Wednesday, so I'm going to upload the Elliot's Kitchen. Other than that, not sure. I'll see you probably around lunchtime. Alright, it's about noon. I just uploaded the water review, and that means it's lunchtime. And for lunch, I'm having ramen noodles and an egg. Alright. Here we have our uh, ramen with egg. Um, the the egg the yolk broke, but that's all right. It'll just make a creamy sauce, I guess. Um, but yeah, um, yeah. Let's go eat it. All right, we got our uh, egg ramen. I actually only used about half of the ramen seasoning in this because uh, I'm saving the other half for my eggs tonight for dinner. All right, let's let's try it. Tastes like egg and ramen. Does taste pretty good though. Might not be the healthiest, but who cares? And, and that's another thing, like if you eat if you eat like this every day, then you know, you're not going to be too healthy. I just chose like th foods that I thought were cheap, but I mean, I'm sure you could get 
vegetables if you had only a dollar a day to buy food. Like you could, you know, you could live, I mean, you might be able to live healthily, but like the way I'm doing it, it's not very healthy, but oh well, it is what it is. So yeah, uh, I'll, uh, so yeah, we'll keep you posted. All right, uh, time skip. It's about five o'clock right now. I've just been like sitting in bed, uh, just like watching Gordon Ramsay, vi Gordon Ramsay videos for the past like hour and a half, and I've realized that I'm kind of hungry, but I only have like two eggs left and a slice of bread, so I'm gonna save it for dinner. So I think I think I'm gonna wait a few more hours until I eat dinner, though. So uh, I'll see you then. All right, so. It's finally dinner time, and for dinner I got two eggs, I got leftover ramen, soy sauce flavored, got tablespoon and a quarter of uh, butter left, and I got one slice of bread. We'll see what I make. Alright, and dinner is served. I, I don't know, we'll eat it. Alright, so there is dinner served. Uh, we've got toast with a crap ton of butter on it because, like, I don't know, I wanted to use up all the butter. And then we have, we've got eggs with the ramen seasoning mixed up with inside the eggs and also some sprinkled on top. <sighs> so yeah, I guess we'll try it. Let's... Tastes like butter and eggs and a tiny bit of... Uh, ramen flavoring, like barely even noticeable, but that's all right. Next up, uh, let's try the toast. Didn't get very toasty, but yeah, it just tastes like really buttery toast. I think I'm gonna eat this and then I'll have a outro reflection type thing. So yeah, see you then. All right, I have eaten my dinner. And that means, with that, I have successfully completed the living off of only a dollar for the day challenge. So, so guys, guys, we did it. So I've uh, added up all the calories that I've eaten today, actually. And uh, I've only had uh, 1,026 calories today, which is slightly lower than the 2,000 recommended daily calories. But that's all right. Hey, I got through the challenge. Uh, Alright, some reflections, uh, if I ever did this again, I would try other foods like rice is extremely cheap, potatoes are cheap, beans are cheap, you know, you can make a lot of food with just a dollar for a day, but I mean, I'm probably never going to try this again, and if I did, then that's when I really start running out of content. So yeah, there's, there's the challenge completed. Uh, yeah, uh, if you want to see more of these challenge videos, then, I don't know, do leave a comment and tell me what you want me to what other challenges you would want me to try so yeah uh, subscribe uh, if you like the video smash like but if you didn't like the video smash dislike um, and as always thanks for watching